spectacular transport was recently executed by freight wings of Bombay. It involved the barging and oncarriage of a very heavy reactor from Bombay to its final destination, the Reliance Hazira plant near Surat, approximately 300 kilometers north of Bombay. The unit was approximately 23 meters long, had a diameter of almost 6 meters and had a weight of 790 metric tons. It is the vital part of an existing polyethylene plant of Reliance Industries and will replace an old reactor which is up to now still in operation. The reactor is manufactured by Mitsubishi of Japan and was transferred in Bombay from Jumbo's heavy lift vessel onto a set of double wide 17 axle lines of Goldhover platform trailers with a net carrying capacity of 884 metric tons. Additional steel supports stabilize the load during the sea leg from Bombay to Hazira. On Sunday, the 11th of July 2004, the barge was ballasted to the ground at the Larsen and Tubro jetty and all preparations were made to start with the roll-off operation of this heavy reactor. Two 500 horsepower MAM heavy duty prime movers were connected to the front drawbar and around 12.30 that afternoon the transport combination was slowly pulled off the barge onto solid ground. The last part of the roll-off ramp had a gradient of almost 4% and both prime movers were pushed to their limits. At maximum pulling force and without stopping they managed to pull the 1000 tons gross vehicle weight up the slope. The first part of an interesting project was successfully completed. What still remained was the 6 km long route to the Azira plant and a number of very tight curves on site in order to reach its final destination. The transport from the Larsen and Tubra jetty to the Reliance plant over a distance of approximately 6 kilometers over public roads was carried out that same night. On site, freight wings engineers with the assistance of an outside consultant prepared detailed route adjustments. The Reliance staff was extremely helpful to improve certain parts of the very tight turns. Roads were here and there widened, brick walls removed and culvert three and four.
बात सही है तो अभी ये दिखा दे कि कौन सा प्लेट जरूरी है कौन सा नहीं जो नहीं है वो नहीं वहाँ के वहाँ पे प्लेट डाला है वहाँ पे प्लेट डालने का Wednesday afternoon, the 14th of July, all preparations were done. Engines were started and the first turn on site was successfully made, whereafter the transport combination was parked just near the second very tight corner. Next day, final route indicators were painted on the road. The second prime mover was held on standby in case extra pulling force was needed during this tight turn. With a few times repositioning of prime movers, the freight wings crew managed to get the enormous load underneath the pipe rack in the direction of the next turn. This was a relatively easy one. In a straight move in one direction, the combination was pulled away into the other direction and moved into position for the fourth and last turn. Although this transport job was far from easy, the freight wings and Reliance project teams understood their responsibilities and solved all problems encountered en route. Thursday afternoon, the 15th of July, around 5 o'clock, the 790 tons reactor was successfully delivered and the reach of the American Skyhorse Crane. As a token of appreciation for a job well done, the project teams were congratulated by the Reliance Managing Director.